Hey guys, Subsy Kid here with another tutorial in After Effects. Yeah, and what I'm going to be showing you today is how to get smooth slow motion, like extremely smooth slow motion, um, like as smooth as Twixter, if not smoother, and I like literally guarantee that. Um, and it's not a plugin; it's completely free. It comes on. It comes with a normal installation of After Effects so that's the good thing about it. like a lot of people they can't get Twixter or they don't want to buy it and yeah so and some people have glitches so they're like oh my god no Twixter doesn't work for me what shall I do to get this smooth this slow motion why did I go Italian damn okay so After Effects make a new composition control in duration longer than the actual clip quite a bit longer so say double the amount and hit ok make sure frame rate and size is all right and then drag into you drag in your clip yeah my clips there yes it is Just turn down the quality a bit so it won't lag okay and now this little effect to get it go to effect time dun 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 time warp and that's it really <laughs> so um by default the speed is set to uh, uh 50 so you just want to change that to 100 and basically it's exactly like twixter if you've ever used it um except all you, the you don't have to insert the frame rate and that's it basically because it already knows frame rate and it's like pixel motion blending frame blending thingy thingy slow motion thing which makes it nice and smooth um, but for some reason it just seems to make it smoother sometimes for me so I use this quite a lot now and I managed to find it somehow I was just like mucking around and looking at different time stuff and I found it so experimentation is the way to go that's how you find stuff okay and now after that it's just keyframing like normal keyframing like Twixter or like normal keyframing anyway so let's do it so I'm gonna Twixter this reload so I will make a keyframe there hit the stopwatch if you just click onto your clip and hit U, bring up the effect in keyframing here, and then go forward two frames and I'll set this speed down to about two. And then you'll see it goes like blah 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 blah, I guess a triple kill and go slow motion. So I will stop bit about there so I'll make a keyframe forward two frames and put this back up to a hundred so then it goes da la 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 but I wanna add some more sm slow motion because I can so let's see so about here I'll make a keyframe and then go forward two frames and then set this to two again or you it just depends how slow you want it you can set it to any sp uh, speed you want so I'm gonna put it to about two then it goes slow mo and what I'll do I'll just make a keyframe go forward two frames and set it back to a hundred like that and then there is that sm sl bl 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 slow motion there and it's as smooth as Twixter basically if you know what that is and yeah that's about it and I think it's pretty good because it's not a plug-in a lot of people have glitches with Twixter like I said before I think can't remember oh my god yeah um so that's it really I thought it was quite cool because I managed to find that I haven't seen any other tutorials on that I don't think there is just let me know even though I don't really care oh well yeah so thanks for watching guys if this helped you out a lot because like Twixter isn't the way for you 
and time warp is um, don't forget to double click that like button subscribe and favorite the video if you want to yeah so thanks for watching guys and I'll quickly render that out so you can see how that came out so yeah see ya